So apparently the last time I dyed my hair copper or red, it wasn't enough, but I'm still not yet ready to fully commit. So I went out and bought a semi-permanent hair dye. So in the last video of me dyeing my hair, and I say it in quotations because I just used a color gloss, not even a hair dye, I used this L'Oreal Le Color color gloss in the tone copper. Because like I said in the last video, my mom's a redhead, I've always wanted to be a redhead, and I figured now is the time to try it. But it hasn't been very long, and I feel like the color is already kind of washed out of my hair. And I liked the red, so I want to try it for a little bit longer, but I'm not yet ready to do like a permanent hair dye. So what did I do? I went and picked this stuff up from Sally's. I think is what it's called, the beauty store. Also, don't mind the hair. As always, it's dirty because we're gonna wash it and then put the color in. But anyhow, this new stuff is actually a semi-permanent hair color. It's by Good Dye Young, and I was actually reading the little packaging and they seem like a pretty sustainable company, which is pretty cool. Anyhow, I think this one on the website says that it would stay from 15 to 20 washes, whereas obviously the color gloss wasn't even a dye. It was just a gloss for people who already have red hair or dye their hair red. So I'm assuming that this semi-permanent stuff will stick around a little bit longer, but we will see. Like last time, we'll do a little before of my hair. Again, keep in mind that it is dirty on the top, so really only the bottoms are what counts. And by the way, how rude of me to not greet you all. Welcome back, or welcome if you're new here. My name's Gabby, and I make videos sometimes, so that's kind of cool. Usually I'm not doing my hair, and usually it's not even about beauty related stuff. It's about clothing or sustainability or thrifting or, I don't know, anything else that I get into. Man, my hair's wild. But today it is about hair, as you've probably figured out. But anyhow, like the last time, I'm gonna go wash my hair, just with shampoo, no conditioner, and I will be back when my hair is washed. Okay, so the hair is clean and it's wet. I've got the top bit sectioned off, and we're just gonna start going for it. The outfit of choice today is an old painting shirt instead of a towel. So when I bought this stuff, the lady told me that I might end up wanting to thin it out because it's pretty thick. And the instructions say to do it on dry hair, but I don't think it's gonna work as well on dry hair, so we're gonna do it on wet hair. I know. If it doesn't work, I guess it's my problem. Okay, so I went and tried to find a plastic bag in my house, which is kind of hard, but I found an old apple bag in my recycling, so... We have an apple bag on my head. And now, we're just waiting. So I'll be back when we're about to rinse it off. Okay, I totally forgot to film yesterday before rinsing it out because I was on the phone with someone and my timer went off and I ended up rinsing out my hair in the sink so that I could continue being on the phone. But here is the product of the Good Dye Young semi-permanent hair dye and the color Toxicity. I feel like it is very similar to the color gloss, but like I said, this one should last a little bit longer. I do feel like in person, this one is a little bit more rosy, and I don't know if that's just something that I'm seeing. So I'm kind of scared that it doesn't look as natural as the gloss. So I guess we'll wait and see how long this lasts. Hopefully it lasts a little bit longer than the color gloss, which it should, but that's kind of it. Anyhow, here are a couple videos I think you would enjoy. As always, thank you for spending this little chunk of your day with me here in our little corner of the internet. I hope this video finds you well. I hope you're taking care of yourself and I will see you in the next one. Bye.